Hey G-Squad, welcome back to an episode of Is It Worth It? So for today's episode, we got this cool, amazing product right here in my hand, as you can see. And pretty much what it is, if you can't tell already, is a ring light. It's by a brand called Pixel, P-I-X-E-L. So first thing first, let me actually unbox it to show you what comes out the package first before we talk more about it and test it out. So when you first open the package, as you can see inside, we have the actual case itself that holds the ring light. So right here is the case itself to hold the ring light. But I'll show you guys in a second. I want to show you guys what else is in the bottom because if you guys look underneath all of that, there is a little stand inside. So here we have the ring stand. You guys can see it's labeled ring light stand. So it's all the way in the bottom of the package itself. But let me actually open up to show you what it looks like. So when we open it up, this is what it looks like inside. So here is what the stand looks like. So basically how you guys open it up is just by pulling all these different sides open like this. And there's kind of like a stand that goes like that. So when you open it all the way, it should look something like that. So you guys can hold it like a stand like that. And then right here, you guys can control like how tall you want it to go. So just loosen up each one of these. So that's the first, you can go for the first one. Next one, let's loosen that one up as well. That's the first, you can go for that one. And then last but not least, you want to loosen up this one right here. And that's how far I can go for that one. So this one's on the ground. I'm not touching it anymore. So I didn't see how far I can go. It go up to right here. And then you can set up the ring light and just use it to whatever uh, distance or size you guys want to use that. So if you guys want to use it at like this low or something, you guys can set up like that. But I put it all the way so I can see how far I can kind of go for this uh, stance. So that's basically the stance itself. Now let's actually open up the rest of the case and show you guys what comes out the package. So here's the case itself. It has a very nice little handle. It has a little strap too. So if you guys want to bring this on the go to take pictures for people or something or do photography and whatnot, you guys can bring this along and make a better setup for your uh, lighting and whatnot. Inside this little cage, you guys can see there's a lot of stuff inside right there. So if you guys can see right here, there's all the accessories and the ring light itself. So I'm gonna take one by one out so you can see what comes out of the package. So let's start with this little box first. Let's see what's inside. So as you can see right here inside, we have the different light panels to kind of like rechange the light of the uh, reflectors to kind of like change the coloring. Cause you guys can use it for white yellow, orange, or blue right here. So here's the blue and here's the orange one. So I just remove the uh, panels from the actual ring light itself and put these if you guys want the different color lighting. So that's one of the packages. Let's open up the next package. So next package we have right here. They have a lot of accessories in here, if you guys can see. So there's a little remote so you guys can actually control the uh, picture when you guys can peer onto your Bluetooth and then you guys can take pictures uh, when you guys are setting up on the uh, ring light itself. They provide you a little stance holder so you can actually set this up onto the uh, ring light itself if you guys want to do like YouTube videos or makeup tutorial videos or anything involving using the running light, you guys can use your phone on here as well. They provide you this little remote in here to kind of control the light. So then that way you guys don't actually need to be right next to the ring light. You guys can actually use this remote to kind of like uh, control our settings. They provide you two of these stands to kind of like attach um, this phone holder right here onto the ring light itself. So there's this one right here. And then there's this one right here. So there's two different type of like um, adjustable uh, stands for the iPhone. They provide you the strap, you guys wanna like hold your wires in place. And then for this one, they provide you two cables. So you guys actually need to um, use both of these cables. So this brick right here, and then this cable right here to kind of like use the ring light. So that's definitely different than the ring light that I'm using right now because the ring light that I'm using right now only has one cable that's plugged in, whereas this one uses two cables to plug in. And then what else is on here is like the instruction guide on how to set the product and how to use it and all the different modes and setting on the actual ring light itself. So here is what the remote looks like. If I can see. So that's basically the remote. So there's on switch, off switch, uh, there's a channel button, there's a brightness button, GP button, and then the little round table twister right here. So you can control like the brightness and everything. So that's really, really cool functionality that uh, my ring light don't have right now. So that's basically everything that's in the two package. Now let me show you the ring light itself before we do the test and everything else. So this ring light itself is 19 inch. So definitely a little bit bigger than the one that I'm using right now to uh, record this video. So there's actually a lot of difference between this one and the other one that I'm using right now. Wiring is definitely one of them. The other thing that's different is the fact that this panel right here, you guys can actually remove it and put a new one on. So if you guys remember, I showed you guys earlier where there's a blue one, orange one, and then there's a yellow one and white one. So this one is the white one that I didn't use, but then this white one also acts as a yellow one. So there's still the blue one and there's a red one that I can actually uh, put on here if you guys want to change like the different lighting on here to more blue or more orange. And then we turn on the backside, this is what it looks like if you guys can see. 
There's two slots right here that you can actually put the battery um, on here so you can use it wirelessly if you guys want to. They don't actually provide you the battery, but if you guys want to use the battery option, you guys have to buy that yourself. And if you guys look right here, they have three different slots right here. So you guys can put the uh, little mount here, here, or here, depending on where you guys want to put your phone to the record uh, when you guys are using the product. And here's the power button. Here you guys can control which mode you guys want to use. So you guys can use the one where it's wired, or you guys can use the one that's wireless using the battery that's on here. So if it doesn't have the battery on here, then it won't turn on. So that's definitely one thing to remember if you guys want to use the battery option on here. Here is where you guys will actually plug in the cable to actually turn on and activate the product itself. And then here are all the different settings on like the brightness, on like how high you want to use it. You guys want to use the white color, you guys want to use the yellow color. And then for this knob right here is where you can control like the brightness of how bright you want it to be or how less brighter you guys want it to be. And then here's the Q3 3.0. So you guys can actually use this to charge your uh, product while it's using it. So you guys can record your video using the lighting and then you guys have this quick charge 3.0 to actually uh, charge your product while you guys are recording your video for YouTube, makeup, videos, or whatever the case may be, vlogging, anything you guys can use that. They have pretty much thought about everything for you here with the wiring, the wireless, the charging option, and brightness, all is on here, which is pretty cool. So all you have to do is kind of like put this in here like that and then you just have to tighten it up. And when you guys tighten it to the right point, it shouldn't move anymore. So that's pretty much all set up right there. And then once you guys finish setting up that part, you guys want to set up this part and then tighten that part up as well. And then we are done setting up both of them. You guys can use it for your ring light to make videos or whatever the case may be. So that's basically everything that's on the product itself. Now let's actually power it up and then show you guys what it looks like and how to control it and how to use it. And then come back and talk about the product. All right, so here we have the stance all set up. If you guys can see right here, you guys can see it's activated, and you guys can see it told you guys the percentage of where you guys are using it, and then the 5800K. So we we'll turn it on right now. So this will control like the percentage of how light bright you guys want the light on. So right now it's at 1%. So if we turn it all the way to 100, this is what it looks like. It, if you guys can see, really, really bright. So it does make a huge difference. And this is using the 5,800. So if you guys change that, let's use the 3,000 one first. So the 3,000 is the lowest one. And 3,000, you guys can see, is using the uh, kind of like the yellowish light on here. So I don't want to flash the light towards you guys because it might blind you guys. So I'm using the wall to kind of show you what it looked like. So if I change the mode to the next one, which is 4,000, it's more like white color. Change the next one, which is 5,800 there, you guys can see, which is why I showed you guys in the beginning. This is what it looked like. And then back to 4,000, more kind of like a yellowish color right here, you guys can see. But if you turn it all the way, it's less yellowish, but it still has that kind of like yellow color. But 3,000 is where you guys would use the um, more yellowish light. So depending on what kind of like light setting you guys want to use, that's how you guys would kind of like adjust and use based off that. And then if you click the channel, the channel is where you guys can kind of control like the remote control. So if you guys want to use remote control, you guys can use the channel to kind of like set it up kind of like a walkie talkie to control this ring light. And then once you guys have like the um, stands right here set up for the iPhone and everything, you guys can plug in your cable onto here to charge the product. So let me go get a phone really quick and a wire to show you guys whether or not this cable charge or not. Basically, I have the cable plugged in right there, you guys can see. I have the cable plugged in here as well by pushing the cable. You guys can see it's charging. So basically you guys can have it set up to record yourself and have the product charge at the same time. So that way you guys don't have to worry about the battery dying or not. So it's definitely a cool addition to have that a lot of other ring lights does not have, like the one I'm using right now does not have that option either. Probably one of the best ring lights I've tested so far on my channel that has everything that you guys would need, ranging from battery, the re uh, wireless remote, charging option and then you guys can have the different settings on here um, to kind of like control it using remote as well. All right, welcome back guys. So now that you guys saw the test of the product, you guys can see that it actually does work and actually works really, really well. Lighting wise, really, really powerful. Uh, brightness is amazing. Perfect for people who want to take pictures, do videos, or in general, just want to increase the lighting to make everything look more natural and look much more brighter so that we can get that uh, high quality picture and high quality uh, video. So like for example, if you guys like the uh, lighting that I'm having right now using the ring light that I'm using right now instead of this one, this is basically what the lighting would look like. But if I were to turn off, you guys can see there's a much huge difference. Like it's not as clear. Like look at this quality. 
but you don't see my face as like bright or whatever and it does it's just not as clear and if i turn back on the light right now you guys can see it's a huge difference comparing to the one without the uh, ring light so using ring light actually makes a huge difference when you are recording videos and whatnot so i do highly recommend getting a ring light in general but now that we tested the product and show you guys what comes with the package but now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it though for 150 dollars so obviously if you guys are trying to look for something like this for a ring light that can do everything you guys want to from like photography portrait mode um, really good lighting for your pictures or videography or just doing youtube makeup video tutorials anything really good lighting like how i'm using right now then definitely get any kind of ring light that's like 18 inch or 19 inch if you guys get like the smaller one it probably works too but around like 18 inch or 19 inch is probably the best uh ones that can perform the best and give you that lighting that you guys would need to get that um really good quality lighting and whatnot and anything about this one the fact that if you guys remember i showed you guys how there's a remote control so you guys can actually use that to control it from far away so that way you guys don't actually need to stand here physically to change and adjust the setting you guys can be far away and using that remote to kind of like adjust it and then on top of that, they provide you the remote so you can actually uh, take pictures from far away as well. But then the one thing you have to remember is that they provide you the wireless option on here to use the battery, but then they don't provide you the battery. So if you guys want the battery, you have to buy it yourself. But everything else on here is really, really nice and really, really affordable. But it's just a really, really amazing ring light to have in general for stepping out your photography, lighting, and video uh, lighting quality. So I highly recommend getting one of these if you guys are trying to look for something like this. 